Hey guys, so I actually just came back from my neurology appointment. It went well. Um, my doctor did clear me to be on pain medication and um, I was supposed to have a pain appointment on Monday morning um, and then we ran into a transportation issue and so I called the office to see if I could get in later um, in the day and then I have a 48 hour um, brain study next week in EEG and um, so the only day I would be able to go would be Monday, Tuesday, and Friday um, and they had something on Wednesday at 1 which is like when I'm getting the study like placed getting the electrodes placed um, so I couldn't do that but then I was in the waiting room when I was originally calling the office about the appointment then they called us back so I was on hold while I was going back to the room then I think I hung up on them because my neurologist came in and then when um, they called me my neurologist was like on his way out so I, t I talked to the doctor directly and he um, he said that um, he'd sent a prescription in for me um, to hold me over for I guess like a week or so or something like that um, and then we're gonna we're gonna have to figure out like where to go from there um, So yeah, I guess I'm getting, gonna be getting pain medication for the first time in like a month today, and um, my neurologist is just really happy. I'm on a medication that is a mood stabilizer, but it also um, works really well for seizures, and um, he also told me that it helps um, people gain weight, so, um, and obviously I'm struggling with weight gain. So, yeah. So this, hopefully, things are like kind of moving in a better direction now. I'm gonna try to have oatmeal. It's actually about like seven or eight o'clock this morning. Like, it's not often that I cry in pain, um, but this was like really severe. I had a really severe episode with my stomach this morning. Um, the most severe I've had in a while. So that means 100% like liquid, sort of liquid diet today and t tomorrow potentially so hopefully this won't be able to well. um and i'll see you guys soon so i picked up my medication finally and um took the first dose so we'll see how this goes i definitely need to stretch um today i'm in like it's muscular pain it's not spasms though um I wish I had like a foam roller um, to like kind of like put under the like the muscles that hurt um, to see if I can work them out, but um, I don't have one, so um, I don't really know what to do. So I probably will um, stretch at lunch. Um, I'm just doing research on apple cider vinegar. Um, I really don't want to take it like orally. I'd like to take a pill of it, but I know a lot of these benefits are like only helpful if you like drink it. Like, so it's supposed to help like clearing a stuffy nose, it's supposed to help um, allergies, soothing sore throats, but that's not the pills. You know, that's a. Um, that's if you drink the actual apple cider vinegar and it's <laughs> it is so awful. It smells awful. It's just, uh, so I'm going to have to figure out what I want to do. Oh, we got the activated charcoal. I got this off of Amazon. Hopefully you guys can see it. Um, and it's literally, hold on. It's literally whew, just a powder. And then you can mix it with water for like spot treatment on your face or if you're doing um if you're doing um words if you're doing a mask or um any of that stuff so i plan on drinking this um mixing it with water and drinking it because it's supposed to bind to all of the bad stuff um basically in your digestive system and it's supposed to help. I believe it's supposed to help like your liver and kidneys and stuff like that. So I really want to 
consume it. I made sure that I can consume this one and Adrian really wants to use it um, on his face and to brush his teeth, to kind of whiten his teeth. So I got the smallest size and if we like this, obviously I'm gonna get a much bigger size next time. This was only $6. Um, so yeah, that's about it. Adrian went to the gym. I'm just gonna be doing more and more research. Um, I think I'm gonna make dandelion tea because I feel like that would help soothe my stomach a little bit. Hmm, I think I'm gonna do that. Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys. Oh, and we found out, this is so random, but we looked up the, um, because the traffic light was like moving. You know those things are 220 pounds? It's insane, and they can be up to seven feet tall. Those things are massive. Anyway, we were just worried that it was gonna fall. I mean, it's not going to, but we were just worried it was gonna fall. So that's why we looked it up, but I'll see you guys soon. Get here. <laughs> Hey guys, so it's been an extremely long time since I last spoke to you guys. It's, um, I think like 3 o'clock in the morning, and um, we just hung out with friends for a little bit earlier, and um, I wasn't going to go out originally, but um, they were just going to like a pool place. We were only there for like two hours, so we did that, and that was a lot of fun. Um, and we came back and we've just been hanging out with his older brother and um, yeah I ended up making um, I don't even know how to pronounce this turmeric um, I got like a powder um, because turmeric is supposed to be like it's actually considered like one of like ten herbs or like natural medications that um, have proven to work better than pharmaceuticals um, and it's a really good anti-inflammatory or anti-inflammatory like herb and um, stuff like that it's supposed to help pain it's supposed to help um, the biggest thing I think is inflammation that it helps with so I'm gonna start trying to have that like regularly um, I'm having dandelion tea now um, to help with some GI problems. Um, but I'm so happy because, like, with all of this research I've been doing, I'm finally like honing in on what I think my regimen's gonna be, and I'm really excited to like actually start this and you know, hopefully. You know, hopefully this will help me feel a little bit better. And like, we're enjoying the activated charcoal. So I just, the only thing with the activated charcoal is you can't take it within two hours of medications. So there's like a four hour gap that you can't take any medications. Otherwise the medication won't be absorbed at all. Um, so that's why I haven't tried it yet, but Adrian did it for his teeth and he said it felt really cool. Or not cool, it felt, um, he said it felt like how um, like your teeth feel after you see a dentist and you have like a good cleaning. So that's really good. Um, so I'm gonna try to do that. Um, I know it's really good for topically for skin. So I'm gonna do that too. Um, I just wanna make small changes um, to at least get as much control as I can possibly have over my body. Um, so that's basically what's been going on, like in general. Um, tomorrow is just a chill, relaxed day, and yeah, that's about it. So sorry that today was probably kind of boring, but um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching, everybody.